plum nut. A man by the name of Dan Hurley, he's a novelist. It really started as a crazy uh, dream, that kind of crazy, loony, nutty idea. I thought it would be a one-shot, goofy, crazy thing to tell my grandchildren. Fourteen years later, I... talk to people about is, is their, their love life because that seems to be the most interesting thing. Oh, this Are is, you, that'll be a very short story. What was the first date like? First date was a little shaky. We didn't really hit it off. There weren't sparks and flames. My picture was on a billboard here in Nashville promoting our show and he called me to meet me because when he saw the picture, he knew that I was going to be his wife, he said. I thought he was rather uh, arrogant, rude, and uh, pompous. And, and I'll stop you here for just a moment. I think mm. these first two sentences in this story are as good a start of a story as I've ever read. Well, thank you. Arrogant, rude, and uh, pompous. Oh, my wow. God. Oh, my God, we're going into difficult territory here. This yeah. is uncomfortable. This is, you know, I'm, I'm amazed that people gather around. I'm amazed they don't beat you up after it's you start like on Barbara Walters like here. here. Has anyone yeah. not liked their story? Uh, one lady uh, slapped me because <laughs> I've been rained on, I've been pickpocketed, I've been arrested. You don't need, like, a permit or anything. Uh, I don't know, do I? See you up the sidewalk. Okay, yes. He's getting angry. The cops are getting him a little troubled down on the street because of the crowd down there. The story is literally unfolding, courtesy of novelist Dan Hurley, who's 18 floors up. With cameras and microphones, Hurley is talking with anybody who wants to make their life one of his 60-second novels. After honing his craft for years on the street, Hurley now practices his trade on America Online. Kind of like the spirit of haiku, I think. It's supposed to capture the moment. Each and every second of our lives is a poem. If only we have the psychic insight to read the book of our life. Woo! All right. Very I love it. Let me just say, Dan, that was really lovely. It was fantastic. Sign that for me. I turned in for the love of a lifetime. Oh, oh you yeah. Now he signed it. Is that I got chills. It was brilliant. I mean, the man is brilliant. That is incredible. And that's beautiful. Uh, checks in the mail. The title says, what, 22,613 people taught me about life. What is the major lesson you've learned? I think, you know, that everybody does have a story and that uh, people need to remember that they are the author of their own life story. There are no mistakes for the 60-second novel. And that's novel number 18,284. And counting. Early himself may be something of a spectacle, but compared to some acts you find on the streets of New York, his is tame. Jeannie Mo, CNN, New York.